All right, I'm gonna go over how to set up the batteries for a Minn Kota 112 Altera. This is a 2015 Hurricane Sun Deck, and I'm actually just changing out the batteries. So this is where my batteries go. I have my onboard alternator charger, and then I have my three bank precision charger here, okay? These are the old batteries, so it's easiest to kind of show a detail. So in order to get the 36 volts you need, you need to connect the batteries together. So I basically went and got some of this wire here from, from Lowe's. It's just a heavy gauge wire. And um, this one here, let's actually see. I don't see the exact gauge, but you can see here from the picture, it's pretty decent size. So the way this is gonna work, the battery that's in the back, you're going to have the negative terminal here connected to the positive terminal on the left side of the battery. And then over here, the positive terminal on this back battery is connected to the negative terminal on this battery on the front. Now, if you are going to have an onboard charger, you're going to have a three bank charger like this. And it's going to have three different setups like this with the black and red wire. So each of those is going to go to a battery, one on the positive terminal, one on the negative terminal. So don't intermingle these ones. These ones here want to stick with just one battery. So, for instance, that first set, you would have your black wire here on the negative terminal and your positive wire here on the positive terminal. And if you have a onboard alternator charger like I do here, you're going to have three more of those as well. So you'll have two of each of these on each battery, one from your alternator charger and one from your precision charger, okay? And it's kind of hard to see, but the black and red wires up front there, I have going to my trolling motor. <clears throat> and those are gonna connect <clears throat> to these two terminals. So your negative wire for your trolling motor will go to this negative terminal on the left battery. And the positive, of course, will go right here. And then let me go up front here and show you the setup I have for connecting all of this. So I have everything connected through this circuit breaker right here. I have the positive and the negative going down into my battery compartment so you can easily turn power on and off. And a good way to test this to ensure you have your 36 volts is by using a multimeter. Put your negative terminal here and your positive terminal here and you should be getting 36 volts. Hopefully this video helps. If you guys have any questions, go ahead and post them in the comments.